Time now for Back to the Basics in Healthcare with Balanced Life Chiropractic, and I've got Dr. Harley with me. How are you doing, Dr. Harley? Good morning, John. I'm doing great. It was a wonderful weekend. It's always, you know, turned out to have pretty nice weather, yeah. so it's always good to have that extra day off, right? Absolutely. And now it's June. We're into a whole new month, and June is Men's Health Month, right? Yeah. So this month we're going to be focusing a lot on just men's health awareness, just, you know, all the kind of the different things that men can kind of deal with different than women and you know, how we're able to help them with a lot of those different issues. So are men a little more stubborn when it comes to this kind of thing? Kind of like, uh, I'm fine. I, I, I can walk it off. I don't. I don't need any help. Oh, you tell me, John. You're the <laughs> <That's>, expert, right? <laughs> well, I, I can pretend to be a man for a second here. Uh, I think that it seems like a lot of the time, and I know men who have hurt themselves pretty bad, and then it takes a lot before they finally get help. Is that a kind of a common thing? Yeah, yeah it kind of is. I mean, it's even my husband's that way. You know, he's, you know, everything's fine. Everything's fine. You know, uh, pain's normal. It's fine. Like, I'll ask him what's wrong. He's like, I'm okay. Yeah. You can obviously tell that, you know, he's feeling, not feeling so great. So it's. So this is the month for men to maybe take a look at their health and say, okay, maybe I should get that thing fixed. Yeah, it's never a bad idea just to go have a checkup to make sure everything's running great. You know, the, the, uh, Fluids are flowing, the valves are tight, that kind of stuff. Look at it like a car, right? There you, you know, go. It's, it's a great way for men to like look at their health is look at it a car. You know, yeah. you want to take care of your car, right? So Get men- as many miles out of us as possible. Exactly. Imagine if you had one car your entire life and you had to you know, drive that. You'd take great care of that, right? Otherwise, it's not going to get you very far. Absolutely. You'd be broken down on the side of the road somewhere. Yeah. And that's that's how people are with their bodies, especially men, unfortunately. I don't mean to pick on the men. That's okay. I get it. And I think we all understand that. <laughs> yeah. They you know, they tend to push it off, push it off. And it's the women, the wives, the moms, whoever, they're telling them, like, hey, you should go to the doctor. You should go to the doctor. You should do this. And they just don't listen, right? So It reminds me. I remember seeing a, a meme on – like a, a picture on Facebook where it said something about uh, – when it comes to health, men are stubborn, and then a man spray painted, no, we're not, underneath of it, which kind of made me laugh. But I think that sometimes we are stubborn, aren't we? A little bit. So, I mean, a little pain is normal, you know, being a little sore, achy from working out too hard or, you know, pushing the lawnmower too fast, that kind of stuff. But if it doesn't go away and it's been going on for a while, you know, pain's not normal. It's our body's way hey, saying something, hey, something's not right, fix it. And I know one other time you mentioned that's kind of like the warning light, you know, so when that warning light comes on, it's not the light that's the problem. That pain that we're feeling is telling me that, hey, there's another issue somewhere else. And I think that's also a great analogy. Exactly. Yeah. It's kind of crazy to think how many like car analogies you can use for your own body, but it it makes more sense to a lot of people in that aspect of it. So, you know, get the check engine light checked out, make sure everything's tuned up and working out okay. And if somebody listening is going, okay, I'd like to get maybe a little information on chiropractic care. I'm sure there are some people listening that have used chiropractic care in the past, but for somebody that hasn't, it's not as scary as they might think, is it? No, it's, it's, you know, safe. It's gentle. We're, you know, we walk you through the whole process explaining what's what and how we're going to be able to help. So we make it, you know, just kind of easy for people to come into the office and learn more about their health. If somebody would like to take that first step and maybe learn a little more about chiropractic care from Balanced Life Chiropractic, how do they get a hold of you? Our number is 605-215-1785, or you can shoot us a message on our Facebook, Balanced Life Chiropractic. And you can also find them online at balancedlifesd.com.